Lebanon has beefed up security in its eastern mountainous regions close to Syria in order to stop insurgents from sneaking into the country. Lebanese officials say the measure is also taken after reports of planned militant attacks on Shia villages in the Bekaa Valley. Chris Mariam Saleh has the details. As heavy fighting continues between the Syrian army and foreign-backed militants throughout Syrian territory and along the border with Lebanon, the Lebanese army has been deployed in big numbers along the series of eastern mountains to stop insurgent infiltration. This comes after security sources said insurgents were planning a major attack on Shiite villages in the Bekaa. The security forces have information that the militants were planning a quick operation against villages on the Lebanese side of the eastern mountain range. They wanted to kill many people and also take people hostage to swap them with some of the most dangerous takfiris in Lebanese custody. Fortunately, the Syrian army, with the help of popular movements, has been able to foil these plots. The eastern mountain range has also been witnessing heavy fighting between Hezbollah and mostly and Nusra Front militants, especially in the Kalamun area. As Syrian warplanes have also raided the outskirts of Arsal, Wadi Nahli, Yunin, and other areas which serve as hideouts for the militants. Our sources have confirmed that the Syrian army, with the help of Hezbollah fighters, have been able to seize control of some of the strategic hilltops in the region, part of which you can see behind me, something which would help in securing the Lebanese border and finally safeguarding Lebanon from the danger of booby-trapped cars and rockets. More than 100 militants have been killed and many wounded or captured. However, the rugged areas of Arsal inside Lebanese territory remain a safe haven for many militants. People of the Baqa Valley stress that the Takfiri militants are a danger to all sides. The latest measures taken by the Lebanese army and the Syrian army and the resistance have helped protect Lebanon, all the areas in Lebanon, not only the Shiite towns. The Tafiris don't differentiate between Sunni and Shiites. They will fight whoever is not with them or disagrees with them politically. Arsal has been used as a conduit for weapons and rebels into Syria or Lebanon, while also serving as a refuge for Syrians fleeing the conflict. Maryam Saleh, Press TV from the Lebanese Bekaa.